Hello everyone, it's Bubonic Zombie. Welcome back to House of a Thousand Doors, the Palm of Zoraster. So, let's get started with this hidden object scene. If you can't tell by my voice, I am uh, kind of tired. Had a long day. And um, also had a long day of editing videos. These videos um, are pretty straightforward to edit, but it takes a while. And especially the rendering time it takes to edit the videos. The, the rendering time is once you're done with all the edits, the editing program has to um, finalize everything. So... That's what I've been doing all day. So I'm glad to get back into the game. Where, um... We can figure out what's going on. I'm still hearing the buzzing of flies in the background. Books. There we go. Okay, there's the watermelon. There's the flypaper. Have you guys ever used flypaper? Of course, it's really sticky, but at the same time, it doesn't quite catch the flies as good as well as you think it would. I guess if you had like a really big abundance of flies around, but if you're just dealing with a few nuisance flies, then it's best just to get out the fly spray and just spray that in the air. But I guess um, you wouldn't want a bunch of pesticides in the air. Okay, we're looking for the metronome, scales, and a star. Well, there's a star. It's pretty obvious I cannot <laughs> talk and look at stuff at the same time. There's scales. Scales are also a sign of a Libra. A very good friend of mine is a Libra. And I remember their sign or the scales because they like to keep balance in their life we have fly paper guess that'll help for whatever the fly sounds that we're encountering how can you get the bunch of bananas what about the grappling hook no okay Okay. March 3rd. I've arrived in India. It's amazing. I've never seen anything like it. I went to a small town named Bhopal. Is that how you pronounce it? I don't know. I, I apologize for mispronouncing <laughs> these things. In the province of Rajasthan. Along the way, I talked with a local who confirmed seeing a ghostly house near a cursed city in the jungle. My new friend lacked courage and refused to take me there. He whispered that it was a place of great evil where natives have been burning ghosts. Seen burning ghosts. How can anything catch fire here? It's so humid. My clothes are soaked.
Okay. Journal. I found a journal that belonged to an old friend. He traveled all over the world looking for the house of a thousand doors and collecting evidence that would prove its existence. It seems he thought the house would appear again. I need to search the remains of this city. The locals are too scared to come here, so I was unable to convince anyone to be my guide. They say an enormous blast destroyed the city. A nuclear attack in ancient times? That's not possible. Okay. Anything? Remove the nails. Don't have anything to remove the nails. Okay. We have a handy dandy map of where to go. We go to the greenhouse. Ah! Do you want this? And it's just gonna shrink away. Okay. Another hidden object scene. And what do we get? Pliers. Okay. What is back here? Oh. Oh. No idea. Okay. something there Huh, it's fish in there. Eel figurine. Um, we have a grappling hook. No. Okay. Chopsticks? No. Okay. But they're saying there's something for us to do here. Hmm. That's why we have the chopsticks. Okay, we have a coin. Something for us to do in the greenhouse. Bowl. No. No. Okay. You never know what could work in these situations, so that's why I try to use of everything. Okay! Another coin! Can we have the grappling hook back? No? Okay. Okay, back to Tibet. And uh, not Tibet. India. Not sure what to do. I'm pretty sure it'll become like very obvious. Oh wait, pliers. Ooh. 
Whoa. That's not good. Dynamite. TNT. Why is that here? I have so many questions. Okay, go into the treasury. Okay, here's a coin. And here's another coin. Okay, now we can get up there. Here's the red gem. Let's see. The old man had only one treasure, a large orange gem. Everyone knew the gem was valuable, but the old man wouldn't sell it. A cruel warrior named Balimuka decided to steal it, but the old man locked himself and his treasure in his wood house. Balimaka was determined to get the gem, so he ordered his lackeys to burn down the house, rake through the coals, and find it. The men did as Balimaka said, but the old man refused to leave his home and was burned to death. Oh, that's sad. Cash. I found a cash. Perhaps the, a skull or the flaming stone is in there. To open it, I need to find two missing chess pieces and then place them on the board. I hope I won't need to play the game to open the, ch the catch. Is it catch or cash? I think it's catch. Okay. Another scroll. Now I understand what the storyteller was writing about. The flaming stone, also known as the Pommel Zoroaster. It used to belong to an old man who made flutes for the children of his village. He was the keeper of a huge gem. The very artifact that was the source of the evil that befell this town and the monks in Tibet. When the thieves burned down the old man's house, they woke up the demon contained within the gem. See, I, I called it. It was a demon. Okay, we still have dynamite. The one who collects the pieces of the ancient game will be able to open the catch. Okay. I too hope that I don't have to play a game of chess because I don't know how to play. Rotate the segment segments of the totems to assemble the images on the totems. Okay. I'm hearing the flies in my headphones. Okay, what do we get? Is that a boomerang? It is. Okay. Anything else? No? Okay. Where else can we go? We still have stuff to do here. Oh, is how do we get that's how we get the bananas down? Okay. And we have something to give to the monkeys now. Waterfall. There you go. A giant can move it, but also can this dynamite! Okay. Oh. Oh, hello.
thank you for setting us free. Now we can rest in peace. The cursed stone is not in the city. If it were, you'd be dead. But there is a weapon that can help you to destroy it. I hid it in a secure place, but I'm sure you can find it. Your heart will tell you what to do. Farewell. Bye bye. Cave. I managed to clear the entrance to the cave. When I stepped inside, the Indian ghost appeared and spoke with me again. He said he hid his friends and family members in the cave, but the blast was so powerful, stones fell in front of the entrance, blocking them inside. Perhaps that's why the old man's soul was unable to find peace. In exchange for my help, the ghost told me I could find the skull in a cache somewhere in the city. Okay. A dictionary. Just what we needed. Oh, that's a lot of skulls. We have a gym. Anything else? Nope. Okay. Huh. Assemble the puzzle by moving the pieces into place. Oh, it's like Tetris. I'm not gonna like this at all. Yep, it's like Tetris. Oh boy. Ugh. Okay. Did not like that at all. Am I going to get something? Is something going to happen? Place one more piece. No. Uh, okay. At least I got it done. Place a mirror. Mirror. Okay. Need something to fasten it. Okay. 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 Well, I'm going to take a break <laughs> for now. Um, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you later. Bye.